Now in Charlotte, heavy rain leaving a neighborhood under water. Water rescue crews we've seen responded to East Charlotte, a community there. Yeah, and we shared that picture just a few moments ago. We want to join with our Julia Kaufman, who is live from Shamrock Drive. So what have you seen as far as this water rescue and impacts where you are right now? Hey guys, so when we arrived here, it's the Windsor Harbor apartment community off Shamrock Drive. Quite the active scene. I'll step out of the way so you guys can see what's going on. Charlotte Fire actually leaving scene now after evacuating people out of their apartments. They say that initially they received a 911 call from a man who was trapped in his vehicle due to flash flooding. Right here on this drive um, in this apartment community, you can see the cars still sitting in water. Um, earlier, the water was up to people's doorways and has receded greatly from just about 30 minutes ago, but of course there's still flooding here and um, people were stranded in their apartments. They couldn't out because of the water. So Charlotte Fire came here to evacuate people, rescue anyone if that was needed, but they tell me no injuries were reported. Everyone is okay. Uh, when we first arrived here, we saw people um, rolling a car that seemed like it was maybe out of commission from the flooding and so they got out and they were pushing it to a parking spot so um, you know obviously this water this flooding has caused damage to a lot of cars in the Charlotte area we're still seeing flooding from Briar Creek here in East Charlotte uh, the water gauge at the creek says it's reading at about eight feet right now um, about 30 minutes to an hour ago it was at nine feet so luckily things are looking better but um, CFD says they just wanted to check and make sure everyone was okay um, as the water was reaching up to people's houses. So again, no injuries reported, but obviously a very scary situation for the people living here, guys. Yeah, just seeing those families walking around in that yeah. soggy, flooded out parking lot, just kind of going, what do we do now? Probably a lot of people are gonna be in that boat tonight. So our thoughts and prayers obviously with them. Julie, it's gonna be a tough cleanup throughout the night. Yeah, thank you so much and stay safe yourself.